In the development of this project, I was helped by PCBWay, which is one of the most experienced PCB manufacturing company in China in field of PCB prototype and fabrication. If you want to make your own PCB for this project or for any other electronic project, PCBWay is a great choice. They have a large online community when, where you can find the open source project and you can also share your project there. From my personal experience, I can tell you that on this community you can find many useful projects with already designed PCBs from uh, where you can place an order directly. Also, you can get 10 PCBs for only $5. So if you want your PCB, just type pcbway.com on your browser. Hello, the HP DL1414 is a 16 segment LED display with 4 printable fields that is over 20 years old. It has a red gallium arsenide phosphor screen to which we can add the Epitaph Smart because it is capable of printing alphanumeric characters on its fields. Uh, the screen is controlled by a CMOS integrated sync circuit embedded in a plastic housing. Uh, this circuit contains RAM, ASCII, ASCII decoder, multiplexer and LED drivers. Thanks to these features, no additional components are needed to connect this display to the microcontroller. More displays can be connected in series, uh, where for each subsequent one it is necessary to assign uh, another GPIO to the WR pin similar to the SPI interface. This time I will show you how to make an interesting mini retro look clock with such a displays, as well as the way in which static and moving uh, static, uh, static and moving test can be written on it. The device is very simple to make and consists of several components. Arduino Nano microcontroller. Two pieces HPDL1414 LED displays and DS3231 real time clock module. Uh, these three buttons are not connected to the circuit at the moment, and in some of the following versions of the code, were intended to be used for settings in the time and possibly the alarm. And now let's see how the device works in reality. As I mentioned earlier, the link below provides separate codes for static text or moving text at the beginning before the correct time appears. Uh, when switching on, the moving text appears first and then the correct time in time in the form of the hours, minutes and seconds. In front of the, of the display, I put, I put a darkened film for better visibility of the digits. With the code itself, we can set the exact time of the clock which we need to enter. Then we need to upload the code once again with the same line commented out. Finally, the device is mounted in a suitable box made of a PVC plastic with thickness of 3mm and 5mm and covered with a self-adhesive colored wallpaper. follows a brief description of the device construction. 